It happened at the park here at the Recreation Center on Levant Street. It was one in the morning. The victim was stabbed in the chest, abdomen, neck, arm, and leg, and was taken to a local trauma center for treatment. No word on his condition this morning. And finally, a deactivation ceremony to tell you about this morning. Take a look at this. It's a Marine Medium Tilted Rotor Squadron. 561 pale horse it will stand down and deactivate at 10 this morning at MCS Miramar the squadron formerly marine medium helicopter squadron 561 for those who are well familiar it was originally activated back in January of 1967 and flew during the Vietnam War the ceremony again will take place at Miramar another one no longer in the air. Oh, well, I'm sure we'll send some cameras there and yeah. get pictures of the goodbye. That's right. Thank you, Bridget. Thank mm -hmm. you. Well, California is transitioning to tighter restrictions on welfare, and San Diegans will soon see some major changes to CalWORKS. Ed Lenderman is in Kearney Mesa with more on what to expect. Good morning, Ed. Hey, Ed. Good morning, Alexis. David, this week, Mark, this week marks changes in the state's welfare-to-work system, but the changes aren't going to be immediate. Nobody's going to see smaller payments or a loss of benefits immediately. Here's what's going on. The state is going to start limiting the time welfare recipients are eligible for taxpayer-funded employment services, such as child care and job training assistance, to 24 months. Also, after 24